All right, welcome back to LearnWire in a brand new year, 2026. This is my first video of the year. Excited to be here. I'm gonna be bringing you more of what you expect on the channel, software reviews, tutorials. I'm gonna be doing more first looks. In the past, if I call it a review, people expect that I've spent hours in the tool and can provide a full review. In this case, I'm gonna be doing a lot of just opening, unboxing of software. These are gonna be more first looks or something like that. So. We're gonna kick it off right now. I also wanna expand on not just doing AppSumo reviews. I'm gonna still bring those to you. You guys have probably noticed I've dialed them down a little bit because I wanna expand and look at different libraries and databases of softwares. And one of them, one of the places is this Product Hunt. They have a lot of software, a lot of people launch, and it's kind of like a notification database where you go and say, hey, I've got a new software come take a look at it. And people are able to get feedback right away. They're able to upvote and everything. So I think this is a great database as well. I'll be reviewing some of these softwares. I need your guys' help. If there's software that you want me to review, leave those comments in the comment section below and I will take a look at them and I'll put them on my to-do list and I will try my best to provide those reviews for you guys. So welcome 2026. Glad to be here. Let's get started. This one right over here I found, it's ranked number one right now. It launched today current rank, daily rank right there, <clears throat> post sinker. It's an AI content maker for social media publishing. I've already looked at it and it reminds me of Publer. You can look at some of my videos on that, but it reminds me of a content creator repurposer. You can create one piece of content and then publish it on different social media platforms. It hooks up to YouTube, Facebook, TikTok, and LinkedIn, Instagram, Twitter, and Pinterest. So, so like the big heavy hitters that I, that concern me, they it hit, it syncs up to all of those. It will automatically create videos using Sora and Vio, and it's good with image creation, video creation, all kinds of stuff. So we want to dive into that. But right over here, you can see that it just launched, right? We're launching right now. Boom. So it just launched today in 2026. Now, this is just their announcement and launch on Product Hunt. I don't know how long they've been around if they say it down here. But they obviously have a lot of traffic. For example, if we go over to the site over here, and I show you guys traffic. This is one way to analyze the success of a piece of software. They already have 2 million people coming here every single month. This is not something that just launched today. They just launched today on Product Hunt. They put this right over here featured on Product Hunt, but this is a full blown piece of software that has a crap load of traffic coming to them, right? So we're going to go and take a look at it. This is exactly what it is right here. PostSinker helps you manage all your social media accounts, schedule content, and create AI videos and images in minutes. If you're a content creator, you could live inside of here and schedule everything, and you could basically get 90% of your work done with the workflows using AI technology in here, this advanced scheduling and you could basically just run your business inside of Post Sinker from what I've seen in the video, which is pretty dang cool. Let's go take a look at pricing and then we'll jump right into the tool. They have monthly over here. Annually, you're going to save 20%, but I always like to look at just monthly. Most people just sign up as monthly. It's $19 a month and you're going to get 10 social media accounts, schedule and post drafts. This is your plan if you're managing your own business. You have AI credits, 200 per month, or one workspace. Team members, you're going to be on the starter plan and hire an assistant to take care of everything in here. I love that they are providing that. So a nice $19 per month and you get light API access. You get a seven day trial. You have to put your credit card to test this out. So that's why you're subscribed to LearnWire. If you're not subscribed, make sure to go ahead and subscribe because I'm willing to put my credit card out there and pick up these tools and give them a full test ride for you to see if this is a tool that you're willing to sign up for a trial. Just know you do have to give them your credit card and you'll have to go back and cancel within that first seven day trial if you don't want to keep the software. If not, after seven days, you'll be charged. I started off on the starter plan. They do have a pro plan at 49 and a pro plus right here at $49. So pricing looks pretty good. Those are all the social media networks, platforms that you can connect to. This is what it looks like when you sign up for the trial. You're gonna see your Twitters, TikToks, LinkedIn. So all those are great right there. Facebook, Pinterest, and some of these other ones, I think one of them might be Telegram. But these three over here, I'm not interested in and I don't use, but certainly all the rest of them. Now I went ahead and disconnected to Twitter. I connected to YouTube 
and I connect it to Pinterest. Oh, I still need to connect to Facebook. So you're actually going to just click on it right here and it's going to take you. I'm going to push pause and you're just going to go push a couple buttons. I can show you the access that you're granting and just push save. And then we are now connected. David Mills has been connected to Post Sinker. It was super easy, super quick. They've made it very seamless to connect to these platforms. So you're going to be able to see I'm connected on Facebook right there. So we've got all these right there. And now I'm going to go to dashboard, right? So the first thing they're going to want you to do is connect your social media accounts. You can't really use the tool or schedule anything if you don't connect some social media accounts. Well, I don't know why it's saying no accounts connected. We just connected all those accounts. That part's a little interesting. Let me go over here. For whatever reason, I went through that process and something I clicked, wiped it out. It's saying that I'm not connected. So be prepared. Here's what I recommend you do on the previous screen. We clicked on those and I connected four accounts. Then I pushed continue. You could see there was a skip. For whatever reason, if you push that button, it wiped everything out. So what I recommend if you sign up, um, go ahead and push skip on that first screen and then do your connections when you're inside the app. That's what I've learned my first time logging in. Here's where the issue was. When you go to connect an account, see it says David Mills or Wire, you have to click this finalize button. I thought it was connected. I must have pushed cancel or clicked the X button. Simple little workflow or UI things that people do make mistakes. Even a software reviewer like myself who's been doing this for years still makes mistakes sometimes. So what you want to do right over here, you want to click this button, connect one account. So I'm going to click that. And now it's saying connecting. And now we have successfully connected our Twitter account right there. And we can actually go and start creating content immediately with that. Let me go connect those other three accounts and I'll be right back. Okay, perfect. So you can see that just literally took about 60 seconds to do that. You can see those other ones are Threads, Blue Sky, and Telegram are the other ones that I'm not really interested in. But they got all the main ones, all the heavy hitters, which is great. I've reviewed and tested out an app like this, but it's missing TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, or YouTube. They've got all those in here. So that is awesome one of the highlights that stands out to me right away. You can see over here, we've got Twitter, YouTube, Facebook, and Pinterest. We're going to go with that right now. There's a lot we can do over here. We can go into support and feedback. We've got our AI credits tally right there. We've got settings over here. After we start publishing, we've got an analytics tool to show followers. I'm wondering if we can go over here and click on the right. You click on Facebook and that's going to tell you post engagements and stuff like that. And you're going to go to YouTube right over here and it's going to say, Hey, we have one post. Maybe we'll try to do a post from here as well. And Twitter right over here. It's going to give us our stats for that. And then we've got our Pinterest right over here as well. You can push the refresh button anytime. Analytics is being refreshed right there. And you can see the time frame right here. So if I go last 90 days, we are looking at all of them cumulative. We got 79 followers, three posts. I got a little bit more stats to look at right there. You can see we're on this personal plan. If you're on another plan, you can create your next workspace right here. Very easy to connect your accounts. You can push this big plus button over here. You can either go down here to create and you can go down and look at your engagement right there as well. This big button right over here, create, or you can always create from the right side over here. So they make it really easy to find everything. Here's your calendar right over here. We can also go look at the calendar and it's going to look like most apps you have seen. Now I did pick this one up, AppSumo Tools of the Year. I picked that one up from YouTube. So what we're going to do is create a post and let's go see what we can do. When we click create post, it takes us right over here. Now we can go into full screen mode so there's no distraction. We can add photos or video. We can write our post right here. We can generate with AI. When we hover over generate with AI, we get generate videos and images using cutting edge AI models, including Sora 2, VO3, and more. Perfect. I'm going to copy a bunch of information about the tool. I'm going to go over here to ChatGPT. I'm going to say, hey, give me a simple AI image prompt for a Learn Wire brand to post on various platforms about my latest video. Here is some info on that. I'm going to paste that right there. We're just really trying to, that's just the image prompt. So we're going to do with that and we'll see how it goes for the first one and what we need to adjust because we're also making a post with text as well. So what I would want to do is create the ultimate prompt, probably using ChatGPT or Claude or Gemini that gives us a really good image that it's going to create, but then also a nice one or two sentence overview. So then we have a nice post created right away. So we've got a prompt right here. I'm going to do control copy. We're going to come in here and generate with AI. 
describe our video with a shot type subject action. All this right here is going to go, and then we can select video. Well, we're on 720p. It's, it looks like we probably have to be on a pro plan to get even higher than that. But when we're doing social media and so forth like that, we probably don't need much more than 720 anyways. 12 seconds, nine by 16 and so forth. So we can go with the, the nine by 16 is fine and I'm just going to say go. And now when you push the go button, that's when you're going to be able to do AI video generation, AI image generation, AI content studio, AI content writer gener generator. But in order to unlock this AI content, your trial account has limited access. Upgrade now to unlock unlimited AI content generation. Your trial will be converted to a paid subscription. So they're not going to let you use all the AI features unless you actually pay that $19. So I'm going to say maybe later. I'm going to go like this and go in here and say create the image. You know what we're going to do? We're going to take that and go into Gemini. We're going to a new chat. I'll say create image, put that in right there, and then we'll say go. I'll just use the tools that I have right now, but you're going to get similar results when you use their AI tool. It's going to do everything under one roof. So that's pretty cool. Obviously you're going to need to pay the $19 for that as well. Now there is a scheduler making an image for us. There is a scheduler today, 11 AM, 7 PM tomorrow. So this is the scheduler right here. Now, where do we go to change our scheduler? There's our time zone right there. You'll go into settings and scheduling, and then you can add more times right here if you want. I'm going to leave it, but you can also, I really love how granular you can get. You can say oh, on Tuesday mornings, we don't want to post or you want to post. And then you want to add more times. You can add right there. You have two slots to post during your week. Editing your schedule here won't affect your posts that are already scheduled right there. Now, I don't know what a max is right here, like how many you can add. Maybe I want to just test this out for you. Because a lot of these schedulers do have limit, you know, sets on here, but it looks like you can add quite a bit right here and then you can just easily take them off like this. So we had the 11 a.m. and I'm going to go over here and add back the 7 p.m. So we need to add back that 7 p.m. right there. Boom. And we can do Saturday. So that's how you would do the scheduling and it just automatically saves. Okay. Let's go back over here. Maybe our didn't work, so I'm going to try it again. I'm also going to give it a reference a screenshot right there. I'm also going to move this over to Pro, Go, and we'll be right back. Okay, well, I'm just going to download this for now. Download full size. Okay, so I'm going to grab some text that I just got. I had Gemini create it for me. I'm going to go put this in as a post right here. I'm going to go and add our image real quick, and that's right here. And obviously you would want to maybe remove that marker right there that says that you made it with a nano banana, but that's fine. And notice that it's a horizontal image. So I'm curious what this is going to look like when we post it to, you know, different platforms, but we're going to go and actually try this out. We're going to actually post this on all four because I'm the guinea pig again going to try to show you what this will look like. Now we'll tell you Pinterest, we're at 282, we're good. YouTube, we're, we're fine. Yeah, we're actually fine on all of these. It'll tell you what the characters look like and what the max character count is. It's going to label your post right there. You can add more threads right there. And let's see what the drop down you can upload from your device, Google Drive, URLs generate with the AI. Remember, that's disappointing that they won't let you actually sample out that AI. But right now, even just testing out all the other functions, the analytics, the scheduler, I was paying, you know, $30 a month for Publer, which was, wasn't, didn't even have AI creation in there. And I was paying that because the scheduling features of this is so valuable that just adding those AI features, we know it's going to be good, right? So that's really good. I don't know what this post sync AI, I don't know if it's going to actually let us do anything, fix grammar, improve clarity and flow, make it punchier, make it shorter. You can click these buttons here, make it more positive. I'll add relevant emojis. Let's try that and see if it'll do that for us. It should add some emojis right there and we can use and edit. So I'm going to click that button. It added some emojis in there for us. That's pretty cool. Now we have all four of these selected. If you didn't want to post it to one of them, you could do that. I'm actually not going to post this to my YouTube channel just because that's where all my subscribers hang out. I don't really want to do a generic post like this, but it's not going to hurt me anywhere else I post. So we can publish this immediately. We can schedule this. If we push the scheduler, let's push the scheduler button. 
then it's going to, we can actually choose when we want to schedule it. Next, free slot, I love that. We'll come back and create another one, but let's just push the publish button and publish. You can also add auto repost. I mean, they really have thought of everything right here. This can come, become that, that massive tool, that uh, tool in your business that basically does what all these other fancy tools have done and that you have to pay 30 to $50 per month. This tool starting at just $19 a month, you're gonna be able to manage your entire our business, which is pretty cool. So we just published that. Let's say we want to do another. Okay, right here. If you're going to be doing the Pinterest ones, they follow a different image size. This is a horizontal right here, but we can click this. We can see that it did post all of our text right there and it did actually successfully post. So that's great. Let's go to check out Twitter real quick. And we're on Twitter and you can see there's our post right there. Obviously we would want to maybe put a link or something like that, but there we go. Check out my latest review. So I would want to come in here and edit this post. We would want to put in our link and all that because this is live. I just wanted to show you what it looks like. I'm actually going to delete this post because I just wanted to show you what it looks like on all these channels. And then also we can go look at Facebook real quick. So here we are. We'll go take a look at Learn Wires, a Facebook page. And you can see that the image is posted right there. <clears throat> and you can see that we also have the post right there. I'll leave that one on there, that's not a problem. That's how easy it is to use the tool. Generating with AI is where you're gonna really shine with content creation and you're gonna be able to create those videos and everything. I absolutely like this tool. I think this is great, everything works. But my biggest con is obviously even giving my credit card and starting the free trial, they still didn't let me generate an AI image. I think that's a little crappy. They should at least give you like 10 credits to use. I mean, we have AI credits right here. I'm not seeing how I was able to even generate with AI. It's just not letting me do anything. And it even says I have 80. So I don't understand. It says 84 credits right there. It says 200 credits right there but it's not letting me do anything. Okay, so that's where you switch to image. Let's go back and grab that prompt. I wanna just paste that in and push go. And yeah, it's just, it's not letting us. We have limited access. We're not able to use any of our credits until we upgrade. So you're not gonna get these credits right here. I think that's a little shady to let someone sign up for a seven day trial and not get to at least test the AI create generator like three times. Just let us generate something, right? Let us generate an image. It's practically free on ChatGPT and Gemini and everything. It's free. Just let us generate something, see how the tool works, and then we'll upgrade. That part is pretty much the only thing. But other than that, let's go to click on some of these other buttons. We have inspiration right over here. So all in one platform, seamless integration, remote work tools. So you have all these different boost productivity digital workspace and you have all these ideas that you could go out and watch and get motivation from we can repurpose these you could actually schedule these also as posts as well so that's really cool inspiration you have your ai writer right over here that you can go in here and start and use for text generation media generation web research I'm going to try the image creator right here and say go. And yeah, it's not letting us do anything when it comes to AI image generation or video generation. You can upload your media there. UGC content, not really sure what this is, but it looks like it'll actually create a video for you inside of here. It'll actually create an AI image inside of here as well. So that's the tool. That's post sinker. What do you guys think? Currently, they just launched today on product hunt. They're already getting over 2 million visitors. I don't even know how they did that. That's just nuts. Like I said, tool looks really good. Other than I just wish I would have been able to show you guys the actual AI image generator or the video generator. But for a scheduler, this just looks like a really good tool. So let me know again, if you made it this far, type in post sinker below. So I know you watched the entire video. Leave a comment if there's any tools on product hunt or AppSumo or other platforms that you want me to review and I will add it to my to-do list. I'm so happy to be here this year trying to bring you the best reviews, tutorials, and software updates that I can. Thanks so much and I'll see you in the next video.